Hey what's up guys, it's Kazooie here and welcome to episode 38 of A Skill Into Glory. This will be the final episode of season 1 and after we, we played these 3 games we're going to be uh, moving on to season 2 which I am looking forward to a lot. But first we're going to try to win division 1 of course. The first game we come up against is actually a uh, Premier League team in the 4-2-3-1 formation, a pretty strong one as well. He starts off with Payet, a good save from a goalkeeper and a rebound he managed to uh, save it again. Then uh, we're in the 11th minute, we got our first chance of the game, of course, with some skill moves. We got Quadrado on the right-hand side, we got him with the spin, and maybe should have gone uh, with the uh, Bolasi flick instead. But we managed to pick it up with Lee Steiner, we go with the outside foot cross. I was trying to reach for Perea, unfortunately his defender got in our way. Then 27 minutes, we gave away a free kick, and uh, it was actually uh, Shakiri for him who steps up for the free kick. Unfortunately, I forgot to jump with the wall. And mainly because of that, we concede from that freak. Really, really stupid goal to uh, to give away, really. And um, yeah, my opponent makes it 1-0. But then in the 42nd minute, we got a big chance with Lacazette. We hit the post. And then from the rebound, that is Quadrado, who pretty much walks the ball into the back of the net. And makes it 1-1. Makes it all even in this game. Then into the second half, my opponent also had quite a few chances. Uh, just like he had in the first half. And he mainly continued on dominating. We only had like a handful one, I think, in this whole game. Uh, this was probably the biggest one in the second half at Ribéry. Unfortunately, it went wide then. Uh, towards the end of the game he is on the attack again I tried to tackle him off the ball I don't know how Ramos actually just gave that ball to him but that is what happened he makes it 2-1 with Payet and that is unfortunately how the game ends and you can see from the stats yet more possession way more shots and I guess overall it was just a more than deserved win for my opponent since I guess we were just lucky that was only 1-1 kind of towards the end but um, unfortunately we uh, we couldn't keep it like that which uh, which was a big shame uh, that means we lose the first game of the episode and it also means we now have to win our next two games in order to win the title and um, yeah if we for example screw this one up if we draw or if we lose it's pretty much game over already since we need to earn uh, six points in total and we only have two games left so this was going to be a really really crucial game and we came against a really sweaty team with Obama Young and stuff and after two minutes or something we already can see the first goal with Thomas Muller and I already knew what kind of path this this was going to and like the whole first half really it was just for my opponent Holy, he created so many chances I was lucky that I didn't go down like 3-0 after like 15 15 minutes or something you can see right there, I tried my best to clear it away, then he picks it up with Müller again and actually makes it 2-0 after 17 minutes. Still not a great way to uh, kind of go into the first half, but I tried to come back. In the 19th minute, we got the first big chance with Lacazette and we finished it up straight away to make it 2-1 and then um, give us some sort of a comeback. And from that minute, we did create a few chances, not many. Uh, this was, I guess, uh, one of the biggest ones here with uh, Ribéry uh, plays it on through there to Lacazette on the left-hand side. We beat the defender nicely. Then I tried to go for a chip shot, which I probably shouldn't have done because chip shot this year aren't really as effective as they actually were in FIFA 15, which I definitely noticed uh, this year. And uh, instead, 41st minute, he got himself a big chance as well. Unfortunately for him anyway, that one went wide. And that is how the first half ended. You can see it right there from the stats. He, uh, he had a couple more shots. And um, when we went into the second half, I decided to make one chase, and that is actually uh, bring uh, Carlos Tevez on for Fakir, because I feel Tevez is actually like a really, really solid player this year. Probably one of the best ones, and I've actually been using him a lot on my uh, normal accounts. And um, yeah, there's a reason why I decided to use him. And... We, we start off really well in the second half. A big chance with Ribéry as well, hitting the crossbar. My opponent got himself a huge chance as well with Aubameyang. I was really surprised that he actually skied that one. And it kind of went back and forth a little bit, but it was mainly us just creating most of the chance in the game. But then in the 72nd minute or something, 75th minute, I went on ultra attacking because there were only like a couple minutes left and I just had to win this game. And as soon as I did that, my opponent went on the counter and he makes it 3-1 with Lacazette. And at that point, I knew it was game over because from that point as well he just decided to pass it back to his goalkeeper just stand still and then wait for me as soon as I ran towards him he kicked the ball forward and just passed around the back and stuff it was really really annoying but you know what I was 3-1 down I couldn't really do much anything about it so um, that is how that game ended and that means we unfortunately do not win the title in Division 1 we were very very close um, I think Mainly in the, in the previous episode, we maybe could have won a couple more games because I think we draw like two or maybe one unnecessary one, which uh, which is really, really stupid. If we maybe won that one, we probably could have won the title because technically we still have one game left, but the uh, amount of points we actually could have had if we played that game as well was, I think, 20. So it's not enough to win the title, unfortunately. But anyway, guys, that is where we are going to be ending off Season 1 of Skill Into Glory. We did not win the, the division title, only decided to give it one go just because I've done other divisions, I think, two times. I think Division 3 
was the one we did like three times over or something. It was absolutely ridiculous. I myself, I'm not really a big fan of Division, so I'm glad this is over. I'm glad we're moving on to, uh, to Season 2, which I hopefully will make a video on uh, this week. So I expect that very, very soon. A sort of introduction video to kind of um, let you guys know what the whole series is about, if you don't know what it is. But anyway, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. Still hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like. It would be very much appreciated. So I'd like to thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.